The video is chaotic, it's intense, and it's disturbing because ultimately you see a man being shot to death in the streets of L.A. The video taken by a witness in downtown Los Angeles begins with an altercation between police and a man on the street. We don't see what caused the incident to turn violent, but the man appears to throw punches towards one of the four officers on the scene who were trying to arrest him on suspicion of robbery. It escalates, ending up on the ground. You hear someone say what sounds like, drop the gun. Then the sound of a taser goes off. Then more shouting that sounds like, drop the gun, yelled twice. A struggle continues and five shots are fired. The suspect lies motionless in the street. Police say the suspect attempted to grab the officer's gun. During the uh, attempt to detain him, the, uh, this individual resisted our officers. They, uh, they struggled with him. They tried to tase him a couple times. That was ineffective. And eventually, uh, the, the struggle occurred where the officers that were struggling with the individual over one of the officer's weapons. Police say three officers fired their weapons, including a supervisor. An investigation is underway. Again, this is at the very, very early stages of the investigation. And that analysis is based on one video, which shows a portion of the incident that occurred. We want to wait till all the videos in that's available. We want to wait till all the people have been interviewed, all the witnesses, all the officers to determine exactly what happened before we make any kind of judgment whether this was proper or not. And you heard Commander Smith talking there about other videos. We understand that some of those officers did have body cams on. And there's also surveillance video uh, from one of the buildings there in the area. They are trying to look at all that, uh, as well as some of the witness statements. They are still taking the statements from witnesses. We talked to two of the witnesses, and they said that before all this happened, before that video started rolling, that the person who was killed was actually tased once before that, but jumped up and started coming at police uh, at that point in time. So uh, this case certainly still under investigation, a lot still to be known, but that video very dramatic and very, very upsetting to many, many people.